heartbreaking and it's kind of hard because then you've like lost someone that you've been with for a while. Her friend, this eighth grader, died after having the flu. His fellow students find ways to honor him. Tyler Sensenbrenner, he died suddenly when the Miamisburg Middle School student got sick with the flu. New Center 7's Una Lee shows us how his classmates and teachers came together to make sure he took the trip he had been waiting years to take. More than 300 Miamisburg 8th graders took this trip to the nation's capital, a trip that Tyler had been wanting to go to and looking forward to for some time. His classmates, including Maya Ferguson, say he was there in spirit. He was just the happiest kid you could know. Like, if you were down or, like, in the hallway, he would come up to you and he'd be like, are you okay? And ask you, and then he'd, like, bring up your spirits because... That's just the way he was. He saw the positives of everything. Maya's friendship with Tyler Sessenbrenner came to an end on the 31st of January when Tyler died from complications from the flu. As a teacher, it was one of the most devastating things I've had happen. I've had students pass away, but never so unexpectedly. And it was as if he was there with us. Tyler's American history teacher, Stephanie Johnson, tells us Tyler was a history buff. I know how excited he was for this trip, and it was like he was there with us. Tyler wasn't physically able to make it to the school's planned trip to Washington, D.C., but he was there in spirit. His teachers and classmates took Tyler in form of a bear. He also made sure the bear got plenty of photo time. He was in spirit with a lot of people, and. It just helped to know that when the bear that was with him when he was in the hospital could be with us everywhere we went and got to go where he wanted to go. Tyler's childhood friend and neighbor Morgan Isham tells me the eighth graders talked nonstop about him. It's always good to have him in memory and we always pointed out, oh wow, Tyler would have liked that. They also wore these t-shirts with his initials and a little heart that's red, Tyler's favorite color. We all thought it was important that he got to go somewhere or another, so. Tyler's parents continue to pay for his trip so several other students could go in Tyler's place. To learn more about Tyler and his classmates, head to WHIOTV.com and also my Facebook page, Una Lee WHIO. Reporting live, Una Lee, News Center 7.